I have no idea how long this is going to work or how shaky the camera will be. Ma, 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 ma. Ma, 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 ma. Chew, chew all the food. Mmm, mm, 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 mm. chew the food. Make sure you chew that food before you talk to mommy. Hi guys, this is Connie. We are back and now I can start doing some vlogging. I have it set up in a, it's weird. I've got this, I want there to stay. No, don't mess it up. So I'm in a glass box of emotion and I'm kind of just trying to distract myself. Needless to say, I'm jumping ahead of myself and we've had a whole day already. It's only two something in the afternoon. I'm headed to the church to pick up my good friend Alyssa and talk to you in the process of it. I don't even know if you can hear me with the air blowing. Oh, I want it in my face though. It feels so good. Air conditioning is such a blessing. So I tried to drive like this earlier because I wanted to go out. I was telling Alyssa I am just mildly obsessed with Pokemon Go right now because it's a great time suck. It's a great distraction and it's something that has not only gotten me out of the house when I would refuse to not refuse that's a bit extreme but when I just wanted to stay inside and I didn't want to put a lot of effort into my day um, I don't I don't get it with the fire oh the turn lane only thing okay I know how to drive so um, I'm part of a discord group which is amazing in my area they totally rock and most of the people that are in that group are amazing as well the majority and uh, there's a new channel for the Luna Lunatone I think is what it's called uh, there's soul rock and then there was the Lunatone which is the the moon shaped rock and uh, I know we're gonna have a long time to possibly catch it but as of recently <clears throat> it just has not been spawning in the local area and so they made a channel for people who find it and see it spawn and say hey here it is so that you can attempt to catch it more so I saw one and I was like ooh mustachio are you totally okay with me like going out and getting this he's like I kind of want to just take it easy this morning I said I will take the baby so I will have the kid and you can shower and it'll be great so jumped back into this car for the first time since we've gotten back because we took a rental car because I love this car I love this car enough not to take it across the country or take it multiple state sides in order to uh, I don't want to use and abuse my car and so uh, there's a lot of political bumper stickers on the back of that car right, two four that one doesn't count. Two, four, six and a half. So, seven. Anywho. Um, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. So I got into this car and we had cleared everything out of the rental car and stuck it inside instead of sticking it back in here. Except for the car seat because I still don't know how to install that. I let Mustachio install Baby Bear Tryon's car seat because it's important and he's very efficient at super important things when I'm not and so I went to go move the car and f heard this weird thudding I'm like is there something under my car what's the deal we had a tire that was going flat it went completely flat the week we were gone and he's like well we'll just go to Costco and get new tires and I was like honey the tread on the tires is still pretty good I said, let's, let's take it over to Sudley Car Care, and uh, they're our local place that we really, really enjoy. I said, let's go check, let them check it out, find out if it's a hole, find out if they can patch it, because there's still some good time and love on those tires that we could definitely use before we have to spend a ridiculous amount of money to uh, buy brand new tires, because any tire shop is going to make you get two tires, not one. Let's not. Oh, nearly. You're okay. You got plenty of goldfish. You're fine. And so, we had that adventure. 
I had I decided to walk to where we parked Mustachio's car for the week, pull out his air compressor because his tires are known to do that a lot. And I stuck it on the tire. I was like, this is really flat. I don't know if I've already messed it up. It went up without an issue. So I was like, okay, so it is holding air. But it definitely was losing air throughout the course of the week. Weekend, whichever, whatever. It's Wednesday, right? This is Wednesday, the 27th. Yes, it is, right? I don't have my watch on. I'm going to assume that that's what today is. <coughs> so, la 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 la. I hope future Connie decides to either do this video again or cuts it so that everything kind of goes super fast because I'm not talking fast enough for the day of this video. Took it over to the car shop. Took a walk with Mustachio and the baby. You can see most of those on my Instagram story. I try my best to upload things social media wise on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Um, Facebook, I've been a friend collector for a lot of people, but at this point now, if I don't know you, I'm probably not going to add you. Or you got to send me a message to let me know you're a real person and not a stalker. Any hoosies. Um, but um, but um, but um, but um, but um. They said we found a nail, we plugged it up, your car's good to go. It costs less than 25 bucks. Do you want to, you should try Googling how much two tires replacement would cost you. Cause I guarantee you, it would not be 25 bucks. So I was very, very glad for that. But all of that happened before lunchtime. And so I already felt like I was spent, but I was very thankful because I had mustachio to have that adventure with. Oh, yeah, we're probably going to add a bunch of extra stuff on the side somewhere, so I think future Connie's going to put, like, if not a picture, then the video of, like, mustachio stops me, and he's like, wait, and I was like, what? We're on our way back. We just crossed the railroad tracks, and there was this tiny little baby snake, and I was like, ay, snakes! Um, and it was a tiny little snake that probably wasn't even poisonous, but the fact that it was the first snake of the season that I'd seen, I was kind of like, okay, my hero saved me from stepping on a baby snake. And uh, baby took a nap. Babies had lots of walking fun, lots of interaction with people. We got back after having lunch and uh, got lunch to go, came home, found out one of my neighbors daughters had passed away two weeks ago I had no I was and like all I can think of is being in a super state of shock like I knew her health was bad hey you're fine I knew her health was bad I knew that she had certain health issues but I swear to you I probably saw her if she passed two weeks ago I saw her three or four weeks ago <laughs> And she seemed like she was on the mend. She seemed like she was doing well. I didn't realize that, obviously, it was, and it's, it, it feels very reminiscent of, like, my mom's best friend just passed away. Hey, what's the matter? Ah, do you want juice? Want some juicy juice? Wash down those, wash down those goldfish with some juice. We have it all figured out. I hate hearing her cry, though. Sometimes babies just gotta cry though. It happens occasionally. Quit texting me. Or quit messaging me. Um my mom's best friend just passed away ever so suddenly. Like she was dealing with some moderate health issues, and then she took a fall at home that fractured a, a bone in her back, and her health just plummeted to the point where her body just couldn't handle it anymore. And I just My mom's best friend has two sons that aren't even my age yet that now have to try and maneuver through the rest of their life without their parents. Um, we have the, the neighbor, the neighbor's daughter, while she was probably my age, 
she has a t- she has a teenager she has a few kids and th- that just my heart just hurts for her kids my heart's just hurt. my heart hurts for her family I uh, it just it makes me really really sad because you know these are people that I feel like we're here one minute and completely gone the next and it makes me really thankful now that I got super r- real on you um, super serious and somber on you um, despite the distractions of life distra- despite having little obsessions with ridiculous games that are just games you know it's important to have those interactions with real life people real real life people in real life people in real life blah, 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 blah. Um, and that makes me really glad that we got to spend the time that we spent with uh, Bobka, Bobka Millie, and uh, a great, basically Baby Bear's great grandma, and uh, a lot of Sam's family this past weekend, because um, I love Bobka Millie, my Bobka Milena. She is getting up there in age. I hope that she's around forever, but I don't know. I can't be the, the person who determines that. she's at least got to see the baby walk and just be the baby I, I would love for her to see more kids I'd love for her to see baby bear get older so that even baby bear can remember it and enjoy it and not just see pictures and video but uh, it makes me glad that we took the opportunity that we did and I hope that we have more opportunities like that in the future and just I enjoy knowing that something like this game has the opportunity to not only like not to get me out of my shell but to get me out of the house when I'm being too stubborn for my own good I definitely noticed recently that I've been a super mega grouch for no reason like little things have been like setting me off and I'm surprised I haven't put like a ranting video on here but I think I'm just too tired by the time I want to sit down and rant but I'm like you know what's going to be better than ranting going to sleep sleep sounds like the right idea so Oh my word, it's been 12 and a half minutes. Definitely going to have some editing involved. I'm going to text my friend and we're going to continue the rest of the day. We're probably going to, we did our first raid. Mustachio and I did our first legendary, however you say, Regice or Regice, however you say his name. That dumb Pokemon. We did that today. Mustachio didn't get it, but I did. So I'm very thankful for the opportunity. I'm looking forward to going to an EX raid tonight. Um, I will hopefully record that, that you're already watching some of it. Spoiler alert. I have no idea what happened yet, but I'm sure I will find out eventually if I'm as half as focused as I can be. Uh, hopefully I'll get this Mewtwo. I've been a little distracted with the baby and stuff in past uh, experiences that I haven't gotten the Mewtwo. So, hey, hey, would you chill? She'll be out here in a second. She's waiting for me to text her. Let me show you this. Let me show you this little, little, little stinker. Hi, stinker. You see that? You see yourself? You're in there. You're in there somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> so it's been a wild day. We're probably going to go to Target, probably back to my house. And then I'll drop her back off. We do the EX raid. And the day will almost be over. Well, hopefully. I don't know if I'm going to record some trades. Hopefully I do. Because we've got a lot of trading to do. A lot of people want that mileage. So I've saved several Georgia Pokemon for just the occasion. And uh, yeah. It's been a wild day. It's only been one day so far. Craziness. Be careful with that and enjoy. Please and thank you. Yeah. Let me text Miss Alyssa. Bye.